in this session what we are going to do is we have to read data from a text file previous example we have entered some uh, data into the file and now we are going to read the data from the file now as usually uh, as already spoken we have we should have a predefined data structure called file and we have to define a pointer for it next what we should do is previous program we used file1.c program right so we are going to use that same program now our task is to make this entire data to be printed on the monitor on the output screen not to open the file to print on the output screen now how should we do it now i have to open this file in a read mode why because i already entered some data into it now my task is to read each and every line and each and every character so which mode should i open the file i have to open this file one dot c file uh, in the form of reading mode so what am i doing i am opening the file using f open function which file file1.c in read mode and i am assigning the starting address to fp now in some cases the file may not exist the file we are trying to read may not exist because of many factors so what happens in such cases we do not get any address back now in such cases it will be returned null value so if fp is equal to equal to null what happens there is no file and we are going to exit the program what does exit lead to exit lead to the outside of the program and nothing will be executed so already the file is existing for us we have no problem the starting address will be assigned to fp so what will be executed this loop will be executed what is that loop suggesting us what is the function that is being used to read each and every character from a file it is f get c so we are going to use that function f get c now we are using the file pointer fp means fp is first pointing to hash then it will point to i then n it need we need not increment fp by default it will increment itself why because file is having that special properties but for incrementing itself character by character so we need not think about the incrementation of pointer fp now what happens is get the character at fp the starting what is the first character of uh, pointed by fp hash symbol so where am i placing that uh, character i'm placing it in ch now ch will be having hash symbol now what am i doing is using the printf statement since hash is a character i'm using percentile c now what happens that character is printed on the output screen so hash will be printed on the output screen then i will be printed then n so on this entire program will be printed until i reach end of the file as discussed in the previous example uof stands for end of the file character now what happens this continuously we are going to take a character from the file we are going to first of all we are going to open the file in the read mode and assign the address to file pointer fp then again what what are we going to do we are going to take each and every character pointed by file pointer fp and place it in character ch and we will print that character on the output screen using the printf statement this task is continuously done until we reach the character eof eof stands for end of the file so after this task is completed we have to close the file pointer why because the task of reading the entire data from the uh, file and printing on the output screen or the monitor has completed so we have to close the file pointer fp using the using the function called f close now if we would like to copy one file to another what should we do what are the functions we have to use just think about that we are going to discuss it in the immediate next topic